Hello, uh, hello Kino Pavasaris, hello Vilnius. Um, I am Svetla Tutorkva and I'm the director of film Sister. Sister is my second feature film. We wrote the script especially for Monika Naidenova, who was one of the main actresses in the, um, my first film, my debut film, Thirst. Thirst was also shown at Vilnius Film Festival a few years ago, where Monika Naidenova won Best Actress Award. Monika Naidenova is a very interesting girl. She won a few awards for Best Actress uh, in a few other countries, uh, a few other festivals, but she does not want to be an actress. And believe it or not, for that girl that does not want to be an actress, we wrote the script. Sister um, tells the story of a young girl who lives in a small town. She finds life there boring and dull. That's why she invents stories. She creates lies. She lies everyone about everything. One of her lies destroys her family. If she's gonna fix what she has done, I hope you will discover that in the movie. But what is the most important thing for that character is to remain human. To remain human and to discover the beauty in the world that surrounds her. In the cruel and ugly world. Actually, um, the story of Sister, um, the main character in Sister, it's me. I grew up in a small village in the mountains. And I used to invent stories. I um, am a pathological liar, still. I just turned it into my profession, um, job. I became a filmmaker. We wanted the film to be bright, to have light in it. We were trying to achieve that by uh, um, telling a story uh, which borders in between the tragic and comic. Um, we wanted to have characters that are sometimes funny, sometimes very dramatic, so as the situation we place the characters in. Sometimes the laughter in the film is through tears. There is nothing wrong uh, with laughter, neither with tears, especially when sometimes they bring relief and hope. There are characters in the movie that have dark secrets. By revealing them, they kind of enlighten their future. Most of the characters in the movie are relatively young people, so the future is ahead of them. They just have to decide how they want to live their lives, if they're going to continue with the lies or they want to live with the painful truth. The film has been shown to a few festivals already and it seems to me that it appeals to um, the young audience. I guess they um, recognize themselves uh, with the, the main character. But actually, um, there was one very old lady who approached me after the, uh, one of the screenings and said to me, while I was watching the movie, I recognized myself in the main character when I was younger. So I guess in every one of us um, lives the young girl or the young boy. So let's keep the young spirit and then the future is ours.